A destroyed South Charleston police cruiser has people asking questions today after it was smashed by a train while parked on the tracks. 13 News reporter Mackenzie Cook has more. Jennifer, the accident, as one witness described it, was horrendous. Thankfully, no one was in the vehicle, but it begs the question, why was the vehicle left on the tracks? All of a sudden, I heard this horrendously loud noise and debris was falling all around me. Jerry Waters saw firsthand what happened to the police cruiser when it was destroyed by a train Sunday night. The crash happened during a police chase in Kanawha County. Thankfully, nobody was hurt because no one was actually in the car. So I just parked my motorcycle right there and I ran up here to see if anybody was in this car. And when I saw this car, I thought to myself, if anybody's in there, they're dead. But why was the vehicle left on the tracks in the first place? I spoke with Captain Rader of South Charleston Police Department this morning, who told me the officer was just trying to do his job. The officer saw a need, or what he felt was a need for assistance, and he did the right thing. He went, he acted properly. You know, it's just it, it had a, it didn't have a very good outcome for, you know, equipment. You know, the officer's fine. The people that we ultimately took in custody are fine. It's just the equipment, you know, is, is done. The biggest relief was that no one was hurt. But Captain Radar says this is something officers at the South Charleston Police Department can learn from. It had a 50-50 outcome. Yes, we got the bad guys, but also we lost a, a piece of equipment, which is, you know, can be replaced and will be replaced. So people need to put things in the right context and perspective. Yeah, it wasn't ideal, but the officer did what he thought he had to do. Cheyenne Carino was charged after police say she led the crash that resulted in the smashed police cruiser. The investigation is still underway. Reporting live, Mackenzie Cook, 13 News, working for you.